So have you ever been using the filter formula and wish you could choose or pick certain columns from the data instead of the whole thing? So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to do just that. I'm going to go ahead and open up this filter. And if we look at this data over here, you can see we have a variety of columns. But we only want a certain few from this. And so the way we do that is using something called an array literal. So array literal is these curly braces. And so inside of that, we can specify columns and or rows that we want to use. So basically, this allows us to build a custom data table for our formula to use. And so in this, I'm going to drop that last one just for now while we build this. And then I can select the column or columns that I want to use. So I'm going to start with this quantity and drop my end row reference so it goes all the way down. And then you can split each column or set of columns with a comma. And so the next one, I'll pick first and last name. And again, drop that in row reference, comma again to split up our next set. And then our final set here will be street through zip. And again, drop that in reference. And then I do my closing bracket to close out. And so this will be my full data table. And then I can wrap up with my filter formula like we do normally here. And so in this case, I'm going to use product. Again, drop that end reference and then do equals and then tie this back to my drop down here, just like that. And now we have this pulling in from our drop down, but it's only pulling back the columns that we want. So that's it for today's video. Make sure to check out the other videos on our channel for more tutorials on both Google Sheets and AppScript. And as always, have a great day.